drive. There are no red flags that could surpass. If he murdered someone? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, he had drive. I just feel like there's not a lot of green flags that's going to overwrite red flags because anytime something negative happens, I feel like people always focus on the negative. They never be locking on the positive. So that this question and their answers is giving me trust issues. But is blind dating six women by height? Let's see what they do. Oh, <laughs> I was not expecting that. You're so tall. No. <laughs> My name is Ryan. I'm 5'5", five five and I'm a pre-K teacher. But I like to tell people I'm 5'6", so it gives a bit of an advantage. What's the tallest you've ever dated? Like 5'8", five, 5'9". Five, I'm not gonna hold 5'5". Five, five. Yay! Dating a 5'9"? Crazy, but I guess short kings be winning too, yeah? It went okay, but you know what? It did not end the way I was expecting. Wow. <laughs> wow. Okay, this is interesting. So you can see their faces, but you can't see their height. So they're probably all sitting down. They look pretty tall just from sitting behind this curtain type shit. This is interesting. Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> How are you guys? Good. How are you? Good. 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 Um, well, I'm Cassie. I'm 21. I'm an esthetician. I like going outside. I like going to the gym. And um, she got I a like tall head, boy. So. Okay, okay. I'll try to be funny for you. Okay. No cool. Okay, we're doing a whole introduction. Yeah, let's do it. Come on. I'm Izzy. I'm 23 years old. I live here, and I'm an executive assistant at a production company. And I like I like a funny guy. Yeah. Okay. I like okay. Funny guys. Likes funny guys. We right? all like funny. <laughs> um, I'm Abby. I'm 21. I'm a student. Student. And honestly, all I look for in a guy is that he's respectful. Respect. Yeah. Respect. Hi, I, I, I I'm dig Amy. it. Um, I'm 23, and I just wanted to mention I am a nurse, wow. and I have ADHD, and I just can't compute and i feel like you get that yeah, same you gotta, you gotta vibe. A little bit more. <laughs> yeah what does can't compute mean like your brain don't work type shit the mean <laughs> i don't know you walked in and said that you get distracted did i yeah <laughs> I don't really Play it. Oh, i'm sorry i got distracted i'm chase i'm 25 yeah, nice i am a barista nice to meet you as well I'm chase music, barista uh, coffee music fashion. okay fashion so, yeah, funny, great okay. and yes <laughs> yes <laughs> funny, funny is the whole thing i'm going for i guess yeah. i'll try hi i'm monse i'm 25 and monse. i'm a songwriter Okay. Um, I'm Mexican and I feel like the vibes you gave are definitely like golden retriever vibes. Wow, 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 wow. Mm, yeah. I don't know if I want to be compared to a, a golden retriever if I'm gonna be compared to a dog, but I don't know. Oh, no gang away. Hundred percent, hundred percent. We'll see. We'll see where this goes. What's a green flag that would make you look past a red flag? Ooh. Good question. Honestly, I'll jump. If you're funny, if we're arguing and then you just like say something to make the banter go well, we'll see. Okay. You would look past any of the other red flags if it's just funny. <laughs> I mean, mayhaps. <laughs> That's kind of ridiculous. So, dude is funny. Red flags don't exist. <laughs> I don't have any red flags in. The plan. Like, if I could just really connect with that person and be able to mentally, spiritually, emotionally drive with them. I was gonna say, like, if they're emotionally mature enough to realize that they have uh, red mm -hmm. flags and work on it, then I can vibe with that. As long as they're willing to take accountability. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and a green flag for me is, I think, drive. There are no red flags that could surpass. If he murdered someone? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, he had drive. He had drive. Drive, just not the kind of That's dedication. I just feel like there's not a lot of green flags that's gonna overwrite red flags because anytime something negative happens, I feel like people always focus on the negative. They never be locking on the positive. So that this question and their answers is giving me trust issues. Trust issues. 
Um, I feel like for me, it's someone who's weird a little bit, but not not in a bad way, a good kind of weird. Like I'll message someone first and literally just say squawk or something so like, like that. Or like, it's just, they just like randomly just scream. What is your red flag in woman? If you're not honest with what you want, Mm. You kind of like beat around the bush. Mm -hmm. They're not straightforward with it. Then Boy, just like, what? I'm just gonna move on. Thank a whole. That is such a good red flag to have. Motherfuckers really do not be honest, and they be telling you whatever, gangling. I can't. I can't. I can't. I don't. I don't know. It's so Aww. hard. They're all so pretty. Yeah, I, I can't do that. I don't like making these types of decisions. This is different. Well, you just gotta be ruthless. Eliminated, eliminated, eliminated. You, 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 gone, gone. Quick. Uh, I'm gonna go with number one. So before she walks down the curtain, can I guess how tall you think she's I think she's five, six. Oh, fascinating. She's way taller than five, six. That face she made, way taller than five, six. <laughs> 511. Sorry. It's okay. Why me? So Why you? <laughs> um, I am not super like into the very down to earth spiritual type of thing. Okay. I'm sorry. He said he don't like that vibe. He needs somebody high maintenance. No, it's okay. Nice to meet you though. Nice to meet you. Oh, Terrible. I feel like a straight up dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. I'm about to cry. Like, oh, oh don't cry. Don't cry. Nah, again. <laughs> Crying. I feel so bad. All right, let me open up my fancy phone. Would you allow me to be passenger prince if we went out? Oh. Yeah. Look, hey, look. Sometimes you got to be in the passenger seat like this. <sighs> Ugh, you know, on the passenger seat reading your manga, you feel me? Damn, this is a good chapter. We there yet? Damn, this is a great chapter, you know? You feel me? Sometimes you gotta live life like that. Uh, would you let me ride in the passenger seat? Of course. Of course. Hand on the thigh is required. Hand on the thigh is always required. Okay. Hand on the thigh. I'm always driving. I prefer to drive. Say less. I love driving. I like driving. I, like driving. So. I was gonna ask, do you prefer the passenger seat? Yeah. I love being passenger prince. Mm, I love being there. taken care of. <laughs> but do you have a car? I do. Okay, then that's that's fine. <laughs> What's the most that's a good embarrassing question, thing enough. you've ever said or done in front of someone you liked? Now, boom! Everybody in the comments, I need y'all to answer this question. What is the most embarrassing thing you've ever said or done in front of someone you like? These are always interesting. I remember one time I was on a date with this shorty, and like she just farted out of nowhere, bro. Just straight clap cheeks, and it smelled like stale French fries, bro. I had to get out of there. I'm gone. Stupid. How'd it run? Feel me type shit? It was crazy. Ooh. <laughs> this was my first crush, and we were in his car. I finally confessed that I liked him. And he goes on this whole like spiel on how he pees in the shower and that I don't actually like him because he pees in the shower, and that's not hot. He was like, you don't like me. I pee in the shower. Oof. Yeah. He, he tried to convince me not to like him. He tried to he gaslight her. In the shower. Yeah. Was, yeah. Gang tried to hit her with the immaculate gaslight. Like, there, you can't even make that up. He really tried to gaslight her on 100%. I was on a first date with a guy, and I ordered red wine. And I, like, get really shaky when I'm nervous. And I accidentally spilled it all over him, and he was wearing, like, a white top. And then we never went on a second date. Yeah. And he, like, followed me on everything, too. And I was like, ooh, okay. Okay, that's a flag. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, right? <laughs> I have told a man that like I love his socks and he had sandals on. Yeah, I just was nervous. Okay, my experience was I went out on a date one time and like I met her and she was taller than I expected. And she looked at me and she's like, oh, you're a lot shorter than I expected. No. And then we went out, we had a good time and then we kissed at the end. And then she said, I would love to go out with you, but you're too short for me. Oh, no. What the fuck? Yeah. No, but you're short, yeah. Why did she kiss him then? If you were gonna reject him anyway, what was the point of having like the W date kissing mans and then saying, I would love to go out with you, but you're too short for me. You're too short for me. What? Y'all don't be making no sense. Oh, you Pick up your crown. Yeah, no, right? Yeah. You deserve better. So that was pretty traumatizing. I was like, oh. It's hard because I vibe with all of them. Um, I'm gonna go with 
three and five. Damn. I'm guessing she's like six foot, like straight up. Do I give that five? Yeah. <laughs> you would be correct. She's six foot? Okay. It's like model energy. Like, exactly. she's so slim. She's so slim. Right? She's so Five, ten and a half. Are you kidding? So she's close. <laughs> Damn. I'm all go. Being short, you must get some of the best hugs, bro. Like, you're getting some of the best hugs. Look at this shit. <laughs> And I'm five, ten and a half, not six foot, but I am giving that. So she okay. gives, like, I love it. Oh, She's so tall. Thank you. Look at, look at the size comparison. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you, too. Second person number five. Can you give us a guess of how tall you are? Five, nine. Five, nine. Five, nine. I was close. I was one off. Oh, and she got on okay. hills, too. Hello. Oh. <laughs> if I release a song called Short King, you know who it's about. Sweet. Well, that, I don't know if that's a good thing, right? It's not. Oh. Ooh. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, we're cool. I just always wanted to say that. <laughs> Heading to the studio. Bye, guys. Oh, and I tried to hug them. I was just like, I was hugging, like, their legs. I wasn't even hugging, like, their waist. <laughs> so that was kind of a... Uh, that's fun. Interesting experience. That's fun, you know. Um, what's your relationship with your family like? Are you guys close? I'm extremely close with my mom and dad. My brother and sister are both in different states, but we talk all the time. So we're super duper close. I think that family is extremely important, whether it's with your partner's family or with yours as well. What's your go-to comfort show? Uh, I recently just started watching Breaking Bad. Okay. Um, Breaking Bad is a W show. Y'all have never seen it. It is crazy good. Pretty solid. Right? Yeah, I know. Pretty good show. Are you a sitcom person? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I also like sex ed education, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good show. Have you seen The Office? Never seen that. Oh, I love The Office. Yeah, that's yeah. the good well, I tried to watch this show, The Office. I didn't make it past like the third episode of season one, bro. I just couldn't get into it. Couldn't get into it. The office is not for me. Michael, Michael Scott yep. is my favorite. Yep. Yeah. He's a king. He's a king. Right? <laughs> um, can I ask one stupid one and one more serious one? Yeah. Yeah, shoot it. Um, okay, the stupid one is, would you rather have eight eyes or eight legs? Uh, legs. Legs? Okay. Your legs, yeah. Okay, I would say eyes. Where would you look then? Like, where you, you like, if you were making around. eye contact with somebody and they had eight eyes. You're looking that's... at all the eyes. The eyes are just like in a row around your face like that. What the okay. fuck? <laughs> okay, then the more serious question is, if you could have one food every day for the rest of your life, what would it be? Spaghetti pomodoro. Because I'm Italian, so my dad mm -hmm. makes really good Italian food, so. One food I could have for the rest of my life? I think I'll go with like tacos or fried rice. There's different versions of fried rice, like curry fried rice, you feel me? Chicken fried rice, shrimp fried rice, beef fried rice, fried rice and a pineapple. You feel me? There's so many different versions of fried rice. I think I'd go fried rice, but tacos is the same thing. There's so many different styles of tacos from traditional Mexican tacos to Tex-Mex to motherfuckers literally just putting what peanut butter and jelly in the damn tortilla. You could call that a taco. So I don't know. Those, those would be the best options. His spaghetti pomodoro is like beautiful. Delicious. It's my favorite. What role do you play in your friend group? The mom. I have like a bag, like in my tote bag with just like tampons, deodorant, band-aids, like hairbrushes. I'm there whenever you need me a at your disposal. And everything yeah. like that. Yep. I'm definitely the jokester and the planner. Mm. So I like to make plans for everyone and make sure everyone has a good weekend. Um, and then also I just love to make everyone laugh. Okay, I'm silly okay. goofy. I would say I'm the communicator. I always try to make sure that everybody knows what's going on. If there's plans, I make sure everybody knows there's plans. So can all Chai be invited. Make sure we Chai all can go to things. And yeah, that's my biggest thing. Just make sure we're all connected still. I need you in my friend group. Let's go. Let's go. Let's yeah. make one. Let's make one go. Um, damn. Who no. do you think he's going to keep? Oh, well. Damn. I paused it too late. Well, we know number one is gone. Who do y'all think he's going to keep, though? Number one. Five, six. Should I go up? Five, Higher. Eight, Higher. nine, Higher. ten. Higher. 
11. What? He doesn't look 5'11 like behind that curve. Surprise! 5'11's Surprise. a good height, though. Whoa! Surprise. I was not expecting that. She's 5'11? Why does 5'11 look so tall? Is it just because they're standing next to him? They make a 5'11 look like 6 foot 8 in the motherfucking video. But 5'11 is a good height, W height. Oh, you. You. You're so tall. No. <laughs> It's a surprise. The, it's the boots. It's definitely a boots. I, like, I definitely I like, swear if you took off the boots, we'd be the same, same height. We would. Yeah, my right? boots are like, yeah, my boots are like tight. Right? It was so nice to meet you. It was nice to Thank meet you, you too. Good luck. Thank you. Yeah. I'm going to go with number two. She's definitely like in the seven foot area. <laughs> definitely. <laughs> seven foot? Hell no, nah, bro. Six five. We'll see. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> no way! <laughs> You're sitting on something. Just, yeah. just five four, board, right? That was a little like platform seat. She's five four. Damn! So they made them like sit at different heights on purpose. That's weird. No way! <laughs> that was the one that was closest to your height, gang, and you got rid of her. Elves in the chat, you got rid of her, broski. Yeah, I'm definitely not a six feet. You look feet. so tall. <laughs> yeah. You guys are short queen. Me over here. <laughs> Wee. For sure. <laughs> How do you feel about me? Yeah. Yeah. Great. Can you guess how tall you are? Definitely taller than me. Uh, I'm going to go with about five, six. I'm bad at this. It wouldn't be hard for anybody to be taller than you, though. <laughs> Five, three. I'm wearing platforms. Oh, okay. Hi, nice Hi, to meet nice you. I'm five, Damn. three, but five, five of these. Yeah, see, I should have worn. I know, we could have been matching. Yeah, we could have been yeah. twins. So he ended up with a girl shorter than him somehow in the end. So I guess we could call this a W, short king with a short queen, you know? Match made in heaven type shit. Look, at they standing exactly the same. They matching each other. Energy, energy. Abby. I'm Ryan. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. 21. 21. Last okay. year in uni, so. Would you guys be open to the idea of a first date? Yeah. Yeah, I would. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, for sure. Passenger <laughs> prince. Yeah, yeah, you gotta drive. You, you can got... be my passenger prince. Let's do it. The short king was definitely a king. He's great. We're vibing. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I took his <laughs> off and him and I measured and we're like the same height and that's perfectly fine with me. <laughs> I think she's awesome. I'm kind of excited to see if we go on a date and see if we can make it work. Definitely not something with red wine. Fair enough. So he ended up with a little shorty at the end of everything W video. Let me know if there's anything you want to see me react to in the comments. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. And you already know. You already know. You already know. Okay.